looking at the corn some of it's beginning to get ready you know you always have those who are out front outpacing the others you have that in anything like in a race you see this ear here the, the silk has turned dark it's not black but it's dried out you just gotta wait till it gets dried out and here's one here there's a little bit of green right there but it's it's starting to dry out good and it will turn black but uh just to show you you just break it off and you can just do it like that pull that silk off now watch this see what i'm talking about this could actually wait a couple more days but when you can take your thumbnail and push it and see the juice fly yeah it hit me in the face anyway that's prime right there and you can see some of these others like right here come right here jeff you see that silk it's still brownish and greenish it's not and the ear is not as foot filled out but that's not quite ready most of this is like that so it's got like three or four more days i'd say four probably probably let's see it's friday probably about tuesday or wednesday probably about wednesday we're gonna ready to put up some, some corn some serious corn yeah all right let's walk back around and let me show you the cabbage all right hit. all right guys it's time to get us a head of cabbage what do you think toby toby says it's ready all right let's just bend this thing down break off these outside leaves take your knife it's that fast break off these outside leaves when cabbage is ready you need to get it or your worms will start getting into it you know your, your white moths they come and lay eggs and then it makes worms and blah 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 there we go beautiful hey. there's our first head of cabbage we might put that in some vegetable relish chow chow yeah we need some hey our tomatoes they're really really getting uh ready to go we're waiting for them to turn now they're not that big but they're big enough and i harvested some okra a few minutes ago i'll show that to you see you look close you can see them all right uh we'll be having that big corn harvest uh probably next wednesday we'll have plenty of corn first little produce from the garden it's looking good we're looking forward to these corn to the corn and tomatoes especially and peppers peppers are really full of blooms they're coming along but they're a little slow and a uh, little bit of cabbage and the okra so like uh, it's so hot here I mean we're hitting high 90s high humidity I mean what's story hadn't changed down here in south carolina and all the south the lower south it's just really hard to get outside and cut these cookers on but you gotta find things you can cook fast so guess what i got another chicken for you <laughs> sorry about that it's either chicken or steak or burger something that's, you're not gonna have to hang around outside because our heat and humidity is like the north snow and ice and cold frigid weather it's just the polar opposite let me show you what some of this corn looks like here's that last little ear it's got a little place on it you can just pop that off you know here's a nice one here i'm hoping more of them will be nice and full like this one Ooh, that's pretty there you have it our first five ears of corn this is a hybrid corn and I was out on the side with the serendipity I think that's this uh, this corn our first tomato and a handful of okra just enough for the table You don't like corn on the cob fresh. 
corn on the cob buttered and salted you need to go back and get reborn Ooh, let's take that to the table all right guys it's time to go in for the bite Ooh, buttered and salted right, you ready first bite of this season fresh corn i believe this is the serendipity it's hot too little blow blow here we go Mm, 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 mm. I wish you were here with me to get a few years of this. It doesn't get any better than this right here. Fresh out the garden five minutes ago. <laughs> Into the boiling pot and then buttered and salted. One more. Oh my gosh. Wish we could have corn all year long. Fresh corn right out of my garden. That right there was eating grits on the cob. What? You didn't know corn was grits and grits is corn? Yeah. All right. I see you. 